New at 10 o'clock tonight, this news. East Texas tutors say they're seeing more students than ever before. The first day of school not even on the books as of now, and many of them already booked for the brand new year. KDK's Mayo explains how they're adjusting to this major increase in their business. Right across from White Oak ISD sits an extra hand for parents. I've been a professional private tutor for the last five years. This year has been one for the books. Back in March, when schools were forced to shift to at-home learning, I started receiving many phone calls, securing spots on my calendar. She says business has been booming, up by 50%. From elementary all the way up to PhD. So it's busy regardless. <laughs> The biggest challenge has not been masks or social distance. That's not the hindrance, but it has been mitigating that learning gap. Tutors are now in high demand, helping students catch up in subjects and prepare for what could be a challenging school year. This year, parents are faced with a difficult decision, whether or not their students will stay in the classroom or stay at home. But for private tutors, they are filling in the gap, making sure students stay on track no matter what. Some parents are gearing up to take on the role of teacher once again, worried their children may fall behind in school and the pressure can add up. With the extra work that they're already having to do at home, they need that extra support to fill in the gaps, and that's where I come in. Jester says even though she doesn't work for her school district, she plans on following TEA guidelines, tutoring students in person with masks handy and six feet of distance between her and her students. And while most tutoring companies will be offering both in-person and online services, they still believe face-to-face -face contact is the best way for your children to learn.